Where's Gladys? I'm right here. You have something to share, Gladys. I live in Flint. I was, I was raised and born in Flint. I worked at the Buick. I love Flint. This is my hair. This is my water. My washers ate up. I have diverticulitis now. Mm -hmm. I'm going to Mount Morris to take my showers because I can't lose no more hair. I can't use my humidifier. I used a humidifier for two winters. I breathed in that water. And now I've got nodes in the bottoms of my lungs. And, and there's no fix for that. My lungs, what are you gonna do for my lungs? What are you gonna do for me, Mr. Snyder? I want him in Flint. I want him here. I want him put in a house because you can take your pick. There's lots of empty ones. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, sir. All I wanna know is there's a law, a Michigan law, that if they don't pay their water bill, in three years, your property can be confiscated. Right, right. I meant to say that. Now, people of Flint are paying for a single person $600 water bill, and if she don't pay it in three years, they're gonna take her house. You're the state senator, and this, there's not a, a bill or a synopsis in this to get this law changed? I'm working on that. I mean, I'm working with the county. Well, there we, we're talking about race and all that, right? This, this isn't a racial war in America. It's class warfare. That's right. I see in this audience, I see black, I see white, I see Latino, I see Arabic. I see the great middle of America that once was. That's right. Flint made America rich. That's right. Wall Street got bailed out. General Motors got bailed out. Right. No one, you're not even asking for a bailout, you're just asking for help. Listen to me, no. and this is not an easy statement. They letting y'all die. That's right. That's right. That's what I'm about to say. That's right. Because they letting y'all die because they gonna let the city die. That's right. And y'all are the city. See, we gotta start thinking about getting out. I mean, I'm gonna be real with you. They ain't fixing these pipes for years. We got to really start thinking about getting your kids up out of here. Now, is that easy to do? No, it's not. See, you're talking to somebody been at all the economic levels. I lived in a car for three years, so hold tight. It ain't like I'm just some rich boy that ain't get up and move. I ain't saying that to you. Right. I'm saying this here. Got to start preparing, right. making preparations, and we got to try to generate some type of fund for the city of Flint that can come in a lump sum, get dispersed, and y'all can make a move. Y'all got to start looking at this thing another way. Save your children. Thank you. Save Thank you, Steve. your Thank children. You. Thank you. Hey, folks, welcome. Uh, thanks for checking out my YouTube channel. Don't forget to click here to subscribe to my channel. That way, you won't miss a single hot new video, some really good stuff. And then I want you to click here to see more clips from the show right now.